Hello class, today we're going to do an online research project about an animal of your choice. And we are actually going to record our voice using PhotoStory. I'm going to give you a choice for this animal research project. You can research an alligator, brown bear, bottlenose dolphin, emperor penguin, panda bear, or tiger shark. The first thing that I'd like you to do is I'd like you to save your photo story file. You'll notice animal links over here and, and we'll get to that in a second but what I'd like you to do is choose what animal you'd like to research and you're going to begin by downloading the file. So I'm going to go down to Panda Bear. I'm going to click on download file. A new window will appear. I'm going to save the file. I want to save it to my student drive so click on this little arrow here and save it to your student drive which has your student number click save it's loading it's a big file because this photo story file includes images of your animal and right here you can see it has 23 seconds remaining and there's a total of 5.06 megabytes okay here we are now your photo story should automatically appear when you click open if it doesn't appear then you want to click down here at the very bottom so you'll notice this photo story has several pictures of panda bears this first picture is the panda bear title page then we have a picture of that says uh, where do they live what do they eat how much do pandas eat why are pandas rare what you're going to be doing is researching the, all these questions and you're going to be recording your voice to answer the questions I'm going to click on next and I'm going to click next again until I see this red record button and this is where you're going to record your answer um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to K5 lessons and I'm going to click on the panda bear link It's going to take me to National Geographic. There's a lot of information on panda bears on this page. And I'm going to research these very questions. You can navigate through the text and you can navigate through the pictures. There's video, there's maps, there's a lot of information on this page. What I would suggest is that you first read the text so navigate through this text there's a lot of information a lot of good information here you certainly don't have to memorize all this but this is a good start and then after that you can look through the pictures for your animal and also be sure to check out the video and sound to learn even more about your creature. When you're all done researching your animal, you can go back to your photo story and you notice I'm on the record page. You can begin by recording your voice. To record, you simply click on the record button. For this page, I'm going to record the title page, Panda Bears, and then I'll say my name. And then I'll click stop. When this page, when this window appears, you want to click no. It's asking if uh, PhotoStory can change your recording settings. Just click no. What do you click? No. Panda Bears by Mr. Hartman. I clicked on the stop, and now my um, audio will be generated, and I, click, I can click preview to hear it.
Panda Bear by Mr. Hartman. Okay, so I, I actually um, recorded for that first slide. And you'll see right here it says I recorded five seconds for that first slide. And I haven't recorded anything yet for these other slides. To record for this next slide, where do they live, I click on the slide and I press record. And I click on what? No! Very good. And I'm recording right now. I'm not talking about panda bears. Uh, I should, probably should be. Okay, I'm going to click stop. So none of that recording made sense, right? So that I don't want to include that. That was a mistake. So if you make a mistake in your recording, there's a simple solution. You just click on this undo button. And it says, are you sure you want to delete the narration associated with this picture? That won't delete the narration for my title picture. It'll, it'll just delete the narration for this picture. And I want to delete it because I want to redo it. So I click yes, and now I can restart my narration. And I can talk about where panda bears live. I want to include as many details as I can. In fact, if you want to type notes, this is a little area right here where you can type what you want to write or what you want to say. So if you want to type in your notes here, you can type in this space. Okay, so you want to record for each of these slides. And I want you to say at least three ideas for each of these slides. The more you record, the longer your video will be. Then click Next. We're not going to worry about music for this slide simply because uh, I want to hear your voice. I don't want to hear music. Then click Next. And you're going to click Next again, and this will automatically save your story to your computer because that's what's automatically selected here. It's going to save it in your video folder. So click Next, and it will build your story. And you can click on View Your Story, and a video will play. You're not going to see this video because I can't actually show it to you now, but by Mr. Hartman. it will automatically play when you click on that. One last thing that you want to do before you exit is you want to save your project. And you want to save your project because you might not finish recording all of your voice for each of the slides. So you want to, if, if you want to continue it next time, click on Save Project and you're going to save it to your H drive by clicking on the pull down menu and finding your student number and then click save. It's asking me now do I want to replace my old file with this brand new file with more work on it and yes I do. I'm replacing my old one with my new one and that, that's good. So now we're ready for next time to finish with this project. Have fun with this activity.